We've got an important core update for you. You've given us your feedback, we're listening to you, and so now we're providing this for you. So we've got a couple of important things in this next firmware release, which is we have standby mode re-enabled now, so that will give you over one month battery life. Uh, we've also indicate the battery level uh, with the LEDs, and we also let you know if it's in sports mode or a heart rate monitor is paired with the device. So to use these new changes, you need to use the latest firmware, uh, the latest firmware 6.0 and the latest phone app, which is 135, 1.3.5. You can find the phone app uh, currently on the Google Play Store or the Apple uh, Store. If you've updated, you probably already have it and, and you're ready to go. The firmware will be 6.0 and you'll use your phone app to update the firmware. Okay, first, enabling standby mode. This is important. Use the phone app and there's a new option in the settings that says enable standby mode. It's off by default until people get used to it. So you need to enable that. And when you enable standby mode, when you take your core off and it's off you for 20 minutes, it's going to go into standby mode and just being ready to be woken up again. To wake it up, you're just going to shake it and the green light starts coming on. That's all you need to do to wake up your core again. When it wakes up, we've now incorporated, it will tell you what the battery level is. When you see three long blinks, of content, the battery level is half full or almost full and it should last for at least uh, 72 hours. So basically three days of continuous broadcast use. If you see it blink two long blinks, then it's uh, 25 to 50 percent charge which means you've got at least another 36 hours of battery life so you can wear it for a day and a half and still have it work fine if you see it just one long blink it means you have over 12 hours which means you're pretty good to go for the day but if you want to wear it overnight and stuff you might want to throw it in the charger if you see three quick short blinks that means the battery level is critical which means you have less than 12 hours of battery life left on your device and it's a good idea just to throw it on the charger for a little while before you go out on your ride that day. So again, three long, it's pretty much full, two long, you're good to go for the day, one long, you're still okay for the day, uh, and three quick short ones, throw it on the back on the charger for a little bit. Okay, now when you, when you charge it, after those blink patterns, you're going to see another blink pattern that goes on for a couple minutes. When you see a double blink, that means it's working in sports mode, which means it's paired with your heart rate monitor. That's important if you want to use it for high activities, uh, sports, cycling, running, or something like that. Make sure it's paired to that heart rate monitor to get the most accurate signal. If you see it just blinking once, that still works fine, but we call that our free living mode, and the algorithm responds a little bit slower. So if you're using sports, have the heart rate monitor paired. If you're just sleeping or just using an everyday workplace or just everyday life, then one blink is, is perfect. So now when you charge your device, the light will continue to blink when it's charging. When it's fully charged, the light stops blinking. And that's pretty much it. So the lights will now tell you quite a bit more information on how your core is working. And again, to use the new version, to use enable the sleep mode, you need the newest phone app that you can find on the Google Play or Apple Store, and you need the newest firmware of 6.0. The app is 1.3.5 or higher, and the firmware is going to be 6.0 or higher. If you have any additional questions, come please see us at corebodytemp.com or write to us or, or look at our facts, and we'll try to answer those questions. Thanks a lot for your time, and please keep sending us that feedback. It's greatly appreciated, and we keep trying to make improvements for you. Thanks.